Hey guys, welcome back to Fairy Wisdom. I'm here to help you create a happy and healthy and wealthy life. Um, thank you all to the, um, the likes, the shares, the comments, the subscribes. I'm loving seeing every single bit of it. Um, and I'm also grateful to everyone who is donating as well as booking readings and uh, signing up for the uh, counseling slash coaching sessions. I can't decide whether I want to call it counseling or coaching because honestly I use my intuitive gifts as a channel to kind of help you work through some fears and, and heal some things. So I feel like it's a little bit of both. Um, my kids are home from school so there may be some uh, kid stuff going on. Uh, <laughs> But yeah, I just want to kind of jump on and do another quick reading um, for this afternoon. If you are interested in booking a reading or signing up for the uh, counseling sessions as well as uh, donating, all that information is in the description box below. And this reading is going to be a pick a card. What are the, um, what gifts? are showing up for you okay um, and I, I want to know I want to know physical 3d gifts as well as emotional spiritual gifts so um, yeah so I, I literally just have two decks out here we're gonna we're gonna pull the three cards to see um, see uh, what um, the three piles to choose from and then we're going to do a quick little reading, okay? All right. There's one. Two. Oh, there was three. Perfect. Okay. <laughs> These make perfect sense. Perfect sense. Whoa, I'm throwing them around. Nope. <laughs> okay. All right, so acceptance is going to be pile one. Pile two is going to be the karma card. And pile three is going to be the gratitude card. one if you chose the acceptance card these are the gifts that are showing up for you I heard the word surprise so there may be some sort of surprise coming here for you okay I uh, will start with the um, emotional slash spiritual gifts when I say emotional I mean like you know like, like peace harmony integrity acceptance um, you know things of that nature so what emotional slash spiritual gifts are showing up for pile one please it is for sure harvest season Ooh, we got grace. Yes. We've got happiness at the bottom of the deck. So um, for you, pile one, first of all, there's this feeling of like you're, you're learning to accept things for how they are, right? You're learning that like it is what it is. There's nothing that you can do about some situations. What you can change, then phenomenal. You can, right? But a lot of times we just got to roll with the punches. And so this is bringing to you this new feeling of like handling life with grace, right? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like not um, in peace, serenity, okay? Um, not being so aggressive, not being so frustrated or so... You know what I'm saying? Understanding that accepting things for what they are and handling things as they come and how they come. And um, for some of you, it's like literal grace, like being lighter on your toes. <laughs> I heard light on your feet. 
Um, and, and that also is terminology that could kind of resonate with being light on your feet is um, being able, you know, quick to light on your feet, like quick to react, not in a like being able to change directions quickly, right? Um, so quick to react, but not in a like a reaction type of way, like as in a, I'm handling this type of way, like your problem solving. There we go. Yes. What physical gifts are coming for pile one? Physical gifts for pile one. time to relax yes work um, if you have been looking for work or if your business has been slow there's work that's coming in for you there's business that's showing up for you um, and also uh, as far as spiritual gifts goes uh, you are really stepping into this um, uh, intuition high priestess maybe some psychic gifts are showing up for you maybe some clairvoyancy is growing some um, clear audience is growing and um, clear cognizance is it's like the discernment on your clear cognizance is also growing um, but yeah so definitely some some time to relax some time to kind of um, you know, take care of yourself, self-love, self-care, um, but also, again, um, work for your business is showing up for you. Um, or just work in general. If you've been applying for jobs and nothing has shown up for you, the perfect job is going to show up for you. But ultimately, what's showing up for you are things that you've wished for, okay? Uh, wish fulfillment here in the star, okay? Um, just a lot of really good times happiness, enjoyment. Some of you, there's a dog involved here. Um, yeah. Some sort of pet. Maybe some sort of creativity. Um, maybe some sort of uh, work. Um, I've been saying that, but I mean like artistic work. Maybe some of you are an artist or even you do things with ceramics here. Um, and you know what I mean? Like your business is growing basically is what I'm, you're about to have a lot of customers, pile one. Um, yes, organization is another thing that I'm hearing. And with this high priestess, it's like guidance on how to handle all this business that's about to show up for you, okay? On steps to take, way to keep it organized, way to keep it moving. You know what I'm saying? Guidance. Mm -hmm. The full moon could have a lot to do with it. That full moon energy could be bringing a lot of it in here. But yeah, so that was what I have for you, pile one. These are just quick little, quick little, quick little things. Quick little things. <laughs> Anyways, thank you so much for being here. Uh, for all of the likes, shares, and subscribes, and we'll see you next time, Pile One. Pile Two. You chose the Karma card. Woohoo! You deserve every single gift that is showing up for you, Pile Two. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. You have earned it in the 3D or in the 5D. You have worked for it spiritually, mind and, and soul. And now it's time to show up for you on earth here. Okay. All right. What are these spiritual and emotional mental gifts that are showing up for pile two? What are the gifts showing up for pile two? Joy, the bottom of the deck. Strength and give. So I feel a lot of it is um, having the strength to be yourself, having the strength to 
continue going, having the strength to trust the process, having the strength to move forward. Uh, there's been a lot of heartbreak, uh, and um, you're, it's, it's caused you to be extremely strong, right? Having the strength and the discipline to um, start a new beginning potentially here. Um, and with give, I feel like you are um, starting to be in this energy where you are doing things out of a selfless space. Um, no longer doing things for a reward, um, but doing them because it, it, um, it feels right, right? And that's what's able to bring in this karma here. Your spiritual bank is massive, pile two. Massive. <laughs> because all that heartbreak from the past, the way that you handled it in the past, and the way that you treated those people that brought you the heartbreak intentionally, um, was very, it took a lot of strength. And you know what I'm saying? It was very um, selfless. And um, the way that you just kind of, I wouldn't say let these people get away with it, um, but you didn't get vengeance, right? You allowed, you know, God, the universe and karma to get the vengeance. And so your spiritual bank is very, very large. Um, okay, pile two, what are some, some physical gifts that are coming towards you? What are some physical gifts for Kyle too? Thank you. Thank you. Uh, not right now. So we do have the devil here, but I feel like I should just focus on the picture. If you guys really like ice cream, <laughs> there may be some sort of opportunity with ice cream. Not feeling any bad energy with this card. It just feels like, you know what I mean? Like when you have ice cream, you're celebrating typically, right? Um, so I feel like, um, you know, I, like that's what it feels like. It feels like there will be celebratory times. like. Again, with the Six of Pentacles here, like giving, okay, and, and but also an equal give and take here, okay. Um, there's definitely some new, um, uh, with the High Priestess and the Two of Wands here, um, some new spiritual gifts that are showing up for you that are actually going to manifest in the 3D. Um, you've had some sort of vision here, some sort of insight on uh, what's happening. This could be some sort of um, inheritance here that's brought to you potentially by your father um, or a grandfather here. Um, there's not going to be any more emotional trauma I'm hearing. No more emotional trauma, just good, good happy times here. Um, Yeah. the sun and the queen of pentacles here no the queen of cups so um yeah emotional stability right um i feel like this inheritance that's coming to you 
there's some sort of money that's coming to you here, okay? Um, and you're definitely going to be celebrating it, all right? Um, but you knew this was coming. So the, it's showing up to you probably this month. Yeah. Yeah. So that is what I have for you, pile two. All right. Moving on. Moving on. Pile three. You chose the gratitude card. This is your reading. Um, ultimately, first of all, I feel like people are going to start recognizing you for your worth, right? Uh, people are going to start, um, you know, kind of just, it's a, like a recognition. You know what I'm saying? If you work really hard, people are going to start realizing that. Um, if you, you know what I mean, what you put in, what you've been putting in is going to be recognized. All right, what are the spiritual and emotional gifts for pile three, please? Michael J., get down from there. Yeah, people are going to start recognizing, like, your light. Um, yeah. Yeah, so whatever has been taking from you, like emotionally or spiritually or even physically, is, is going to be given back to you here, okay? Um, and the biggest reason is because you are, you are very grateful for everything, right? Um, but yeah, there's been some sort of clarity about who you are as an earth angel here. Um, that's going to allow this recognition to come in. I feel like there has been a lack of your efforts, your hard work, and um, so that's definitely coming in as far as, you know, non-physical, tangible things. That recognition could come in a tangible thing, um, but... For some of you, yeah, and some of you not. Okay, what are the physical gifts that are showing up for pile three? So you're definitely going to be able to stop overthinking things here, okay? Um, wondering when, when it's going to happen, what's going to happen, why, what am I, you know, um, yeah, there's been some sort of, people have been watching you, pile three. Yeah, there's some sort of gratitude that's coming towards you, okay? Uh, some sort of uh, gift, physical gift, uh, probably financial, that's going to bring some balance here. Notice they've got plenty of food here. They're drinking wine, celebrating a little bit here. Um, definitely some balance in your finances. Um, and I think you've been wondering, you know what I'm saying? Like you've just been burning at both ends here. And so also with that, um, you know, you're going to, I feel like there could be some sort of vacation, a vacation that comes for you here. Um, for sure. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Could be some sort of financial gift as well as like a, a paid vacation here. But I do, I am hearing like a lump sum, a lump sum of money, okay? Um, 
Yeah. All right, so that is what I have for you. <laughs> These are just quick little messages. Thank you so much for being here, and we'll see you next time.